Ladies and we are back. Um, in this upload, we are going to be looking at that a Nashville overdrive sound um, via Korea. Um, I've really struggled with drive pedals. Really, really struggled with drive pedals. So much so that I don't think I've really used one for a long time because I could never get the sound I liked. It was always a fuzz roll back or the amp attenuated. And um, I'd seen like a lot of buzz going on about obviously the Nobles ODR one. And, um, and I had one, I had two actually in the past that really didn't work for me. Um, now, a bit of history about them. I think that they've had many shapes and forms over the years and many in the same line are all meant to be kind of different. Um, I can't verify that, I'm only talking from personal experience. Uh, and I kind of wrote them off. And then um, late night on eBay, um, I just seen an ODR one original come up. It was like 500 quid and I was like dead set against it. I was like, that's crazy money. There's no way I'm paying that for an overdrive. Um, and then like a little bit further down was this Rhino Ram. Uh, I mean, like the original is not the best looking pedals. Um, but it's basically an ODI one. Um, original inside I've opened it up it's the same it's the same board 1993 this was made um, it says nobles on the back and the circuit inside the circuit board inside is a nobles ODR one um, and I have not stopped playing this uh, so much so I've took my attenuator off my amp and uh, I mean I haven't played my vibro verbat and attenuator for pretty much almost his entire life that has been with me um, but this, this is just, the tone is just incredible. Um, so this video is just sharing that. You know, I found a tone that I really, really like. It just works well with everything. It's, the drive is great. There's, it's articulate. It just works, man. Um, you know, let alone trying to copy a sound or anything like that. It's a drive that I really, really like. And it's just been sat on top of my amp. And I've been using like a lot of famous players using the level as a master volume. Um, that being said, the vibro verb is only on two and a half, and with the drive pedals before previous to that, it usually sounds garbage. You need the vibro up on like five, six. This with the vibro verb on two and a half, in, in my opinion, is quite possibly one of my favorite. Well, it is my favorite drive sound I've ever had. So much so, I think I'm gonna, you know, I've been toying the idea of just changing the casing. Um, to make it more suited for me. Um, but yeah, if you guys see one of these, this is a Rhino Ram. If you guys see one of these and you're not sure about it, I, I would jump on it. Uh, I think they're probably rarer than the originals um, and they were a third of the price. So yeah, you can see why I'm frothing about it. Anyway, there's enough talking. Um, I'm just gonna dial in the tone I like and just play you through it. Um, Works fantastic with humbuckers, works great with single coils, all, all down to this spectrum dial. There's much like a tone knob, but just better. Uh, there's plenty of drive if you want it and, and plenty of volume on tap. And the added function of the battery slot here is just genius. Um, it's amazing, man. I'm really enjoying this pedal. Let's get into the tones. Thank you. 